I'm going to start out talking about our Ag Developer Network, which is Turbo is excited to announce that today. So we're launching a brand new website that will be allowing our customers, uh, both developers and resellers, to participate in the precision farming experience with the TMX 2050 display, as well as with Connected Farm. So what that means is we have, we're creating a community of like-minded precision farming developers. So whether it's creating an app on the TMX 2050 display, or using a data connection into Connected Farm, we are supporting and fostering that environment for everyone to participate and be involved with Trouble. So you can head to the website today, it's agdeveloper.trouble.com, and you'll be able to see uh, how to get started. So whether downloading the um, SDK or software developer kit for the TMX display, or um, requesting data access to Connected Farm through the API um, request form. So from this website, you're able to also submit your application. So whether it's a new idea or concept, or by going and submitting an existing application on, that's already posted on Google Play or an App Store. As I mentioned, we also have Connected Farm APIs available. And recently, within the last month, we announced the um, Connected Farm API integration with Agco. So we have a partnership for data sharing with them, which allows uh, customers to access data through the Ag Command portal directly in Connected Farm, and also from Veriadoc displays. We're very excited to announce the Ag Co partnership, and we look forward to many more API integrations in the Connected Farm. So today we're also announcing the new firmware version on the TMX2050 display version 3.0, which introduces in support of our Ag Developer Network uh, the App Central application, which you see on the inset there on the display. Um, we're also supporting the Software Developer Kit for non-integrated applications, and I'll get into a few new applications that we've launched on the display with App Central. Also, to support all of these connectivity features, every TMX that's sold now has the ability to come with the DCM modem for free. So connectivity should be, become standard with all of our displays across the board. bit more about App Central. So some of us are used to an app marketplace type scenario where you can download, manage, install, add in passwords, or view more details on your application devices already. Um, so we're introducing a similar type feature for the TMX. Being an Android device, it only makes sense that you can manage your applications in one centrally located place. So from here, you'll be able to see a little bit more detail on our app card. So each application now comes with a window with full details about what's included in the applications, what languages it's supported in, as well as any of the screenshots from the application. Very typical from what you would experience from other marketplaces up there today. Um, you'll also notice that there's an install and contact developer feature, so any of, the, uh, any of our customers using the TMX2050 display can also have access to the de developer directly if they have an issue or if they need to purchase a login for some of those password protected applications. So we have a couple of new applications on the TMX2050 display. Um, first we have from Datamax, which is our Swedish reseller. Um, they've introduced a new application that allows them to connect with their um, back-end desktop software. So it's support for chemical regulations specific to Swedish farming practices. So that's their application. And then we've also introduced um, Copilot uh, by Tremble or uh, ALK Technologies, which is a Tremble company. And Copilot introduces turn by turn navigation specific to weight and cargo restrictions. So when you're hauling a big sprayer with a lot of chemicals, it's got wide dimensions. You're able to input that into Copilot and it'll route you accordingly onto whichever path you need to access your field. Um. So I'm going to give you some updates on Connected Farm. We were evolving around uh, some, some bundles and new features that we're inputting in the system to allow Connected Farm to be sold in commodities or be consumed by the farmer bodies. So for those of you that aren't familiar with Connected Farm, it is a web-based data management system. It's a farm management platform. And for the grower, the advantages of some of this is to create that system where we are doing a lot of the work for them as far as the data management perspective is concerned. We are bringing the 
data in via a wireless transfer system. We're taking that data and manipulating it for the grower so they don't have to spend time in front of the computer figuring out what to do with files. And then we are visualizing that data for them. Um, so that way, that workflow is streamlined and what they are doing is doing their work in the field and coming back to the office or on their phone or on their tablets just to view that data instantaneously. Um, the next thing is that the Connected Farm is compatible with multi-brands of equipment. Right? So our fleet telematics is compatible with, with all the colors that are out there, many machines. Um, we have thousands of machines supported with, with Connected Farm Telematics and the data format coming in from not just a Trimble display, but other industry displays such as CNH, Agco, etc. coming into Connected Farm. Connected Farm also allows the farmer to instantly share information with important team members, the people that they use to help them manage their operation. So this is internal team members. It can be their person that's in charge of their machines in the field, their operations, etc. Um, also importantly is that the connected farm data is also shareable with external members as well, such as a, a hired agronomist, crop consultant, things like that. So the bundles, why bundles? Why is that important? Well, what we hear all the time, the challenge in this data age, this data platform age, there are many solutions out of the market today, many products for managing data. There's so many, it's confusing. They do a piece over here, a piece over here, and a piece over here. But as a farmer, that's confusing. You need help putting together the pieces that will help me run my operation. I don't want to go to five different spots or 10 different spots to get the product in each one. I try to tie it all together myself. For one, I'm still trying to learn this and what I need and what my needs are and how to address that. So we've put together, we have all those tools, but it's maybe not always apparent. So what we've done is we've gathered all these tools together that are relevant to a farm and say, okay, you buy this one package, it has everything you need, you're done with it. Um, so that's what I'm gonna show you. So again, it eliminates that confusing and it creates that value. The other thing that you achieve by doing that, putting all these, these things together, is the farmer does um, see some tremendous value from bringing those things together. If they piece all those things out separately, that's considering if they had figured out all the pieces to get, it, is, uh, it's, it represents a lot of value on top of that. And I'll show you what some of those numbers look like. So there are two bundles. Um, I'm gonna go through what each one has in the following slides, but there is a free entry level get started bundle. This is the, I, I wanted to call this one the no-brainer bundle, right? You just get into it, it's free to get started. The farmer can do it themselves if they choose to do so, or work through one of our resellers to get started. Um, it, it contains the, the things that are most common in the industry, the easiest to grasp and to get started with. And then we have our standard bundle that goes beyond that and offers more insights and more value to that package. Okay, so we'll start with the free. It contains these elements here, and some of the things you may be familiar with, we've talked about them in the past, and they're the things that we have um, provided out there to the market that they can get into just by signing up. Right? So the, the first thing is the operations dashboard. This is the, this is the portal, this is the main entry screen that a farmer's gonna go to, even if he's got 30 seconds or if he's got 30 minutes, the dashboard provides that really quick snapshot of what's going on in the farm. From that information, the, the farmer can decide to either make a decision or to not. Um, if everything's going on track, no issues, keep going with the day, you might see something that needs some attention and can make a quick decision. Uh, data upload is up here because I think that's a, uh, that's kind of a forgotten or something that's taken for granted in a data platform. Um, it costs money, typically, to upload lots of files into something. Even if they have their desktop computer loading into their hard drive, that's that's an expense, right? Like hardware costs money, storage costs money. Um, so, so it's really, it's a tremendous value because this right now is offering unlimited data upload into the system. We're helping the farmer 
farmer manage that data through secure storage and it is there for them. Um, upload of boundaries, either through mobile apps or through uh, USB sticks, many ways to get the data into the system. Um, and new to this package is a basic mapping feature. So what we're allowing here is the user of this free system to start visualizing some of the data in a basic level of detail. So it is uh, a really quick view of the map that came in, whether it's yield, planting, etc. cetera. Um, the farmer can now see a basic view of that. And the other package we get to, I'll, I'll tell you how we expand on that. A basic fleet management is also part of this package. And what that means is that the grower with the DCM, uh, with the modem or telematics device, as long as they have that, they're going to get a basic uh, track and trace, a basic dot on the map where the machine is without having to pay for anything yet. So again, it's giving them that first level of information that comes through, starts letting them see how, how easy this is to start seeing some data and value that they can get from it. Field profit summary is really important. It's a really cool feature because once all the farmer has to do is input costs for what his operator's cost per hour, what it costs to run a machine per hour, and a couple of chemical costs. And from there, anytime a task comes through, automatically we will calculate the cost or loss, the, the, the profit or loss per yield on the farm. That's a really powerful tool because, again, the farmer that's using this doesn't have to do that daily data manipulation. This is happening automatically. And again, our mobile apps tie into this as well, whether you're doing your fleet tracking or field records. Um, lastly, part of this, this package as well is if we have a farmer that's using FarmWorks software, we've always been asked, how are you guys tying FarmWorks desktop software technology to this new web-based data management? Right, we get that question all the time. It's throughout the industry of the other folks that have software and web platforms. Well, we are now tying much of the data together. Everything except the maps today is being tied back and forth between connected farm and farmers. So this allows the farmer that is doing that more advanced level of mapping, they're maybe doing also farm office accounting, something, something really rich with a really rich feature set, but they also want the accessibility, the ease of use, um, some of the newer technology that web-based platforms bring. So this, again, without their data manipulation, this happens automatically, seeking field names and boundaries and materials and resources. A lot of this finite level of detail that would just take forever to do manually. Because we also get asked, well, I've got 10 years worth of data in FarmWorks. How do I, how do I move that? How do I bring that over to Connected Farm? This is the start of that answer. OK, now we get into the standard bundle. I'll cover pricing right after this one. But this is all the features of Connected Farm Free, plus the next level of, the, of advancement. This gives the user unlimited wireless data transfer. Okay, So what that means is that no longer does a farmer have to pay subscription fees per machine that they put onto a system. That has been really cost prohibitive in the past um, with the feedback we get from the market. Um, it becomes very expensive very quickly for a farmer to add more than several machines to a plan. So now, sign up to one platform, one price. It doesn't matter if you have two machines or 200 machines. We're going to help you out and accept all the data in the system and help you manage that. The task analysis for each field, each map, is in, in, is in the utmost detail. You can zoom in all the way to see those skips. You can see planting overlaps. You can see all of that detail. Every cost is detailed and um, all the information, such as driver information, all of that is all relevant and easily available. This allows you then to then have this machine and workforce utilization. So what this is, and I can talk about that more further after this presentation, but this is a utilization chart for a machine versus the work that it did in the field. So machine uptime, operator productivity, all rolled into this graph that tells the farmer exactly how his machines are being used and how his operators are performing. So this can be used to address um, best case work practices so that he can do more training for other operators underperforming machines.
shot. Precision crop health maps. This is our pure pixel satellite imagery, giving that precision health map. And again, we've talked about this in the past, but it's a really unique crop health. It's an absolute value crop health, unlike anybody else in the industry. And this comes as part of this package. No more charges by the acre. You get all the acres for your tier, uh, all the images that you want here. Also new is UAV image processing. So UAV is the big buzz out there, right? So the problem is how do I bring that in again to my combined universal data platform? I have my UAV software over here. I've got my mapping software over here, my accounting software over here. I think you get the picture, right? So we're trying to bring this all together. We do offer UAVs as well, but what we see is that no matter what UAV you're using, we still want you to be able to use our platform to bring that data in, and we will process an NDVI image for that, store it for you, let you see that next to your pure pixel, next to your planting map, next to your yield map, as, uh, as you need to manage that. And then as Stephanie discussed, is we're definitely coming strong in this integration with third parties. We do stand by that. We do want to integrate with, with those other um, data systems that the farmer may have on their operation, especially when it pertains to a mixed fleet situation. So the ACO, Acumen, part of their Fuse Technologies is the first. Okay, now getting into pricing here. Um, Connected Farm Standard, um, you're able to order this from a reseller. So if a farmer is already working with a triple reseller, they can help you through that process. And, or alternatively, they can call us direct to triple at this point, under number. And we will help them through that. We'll help them find the reseller that's closest to them when it's an expert in data management. Now this bundle is $3,500 a year for 2,000 acres. What we see in the marketplace today is there, there's a lot of disparity in prices. You see a dollar an acre here, two dollars an acre here, that type of thing. This is $3,500 a year for 2,000 acres. We also offer $4,000, $6,000 and a custom price after $6,000. But this has a tremendous value. Here's a, here's a quick spreadsheet. So everything that we're providing, these are the most popular things that farmers are asking us for today. So we've, we've added them up right here all individually so we can see what kind of value this is bringing. So if it's a 2,000 acre farm, four machines with two employees accessing the data, and by the way, the bundles that I just showed you are unlimited access. You can have one employee or 100 employees accessing this data. All of this comes out to about $6,700 that, that uh, a farmer would have to pay individually, probably painfully, multiple credit card transactions, that type of thing. So one-time payment of $3,500 gives the farmer all of this stuff ultimately.